Praise the name of the Lord. Shalom, family. Once again, you're welcome. Welcome to this amazing, great, awesome, what awesome session. It's your friend and your sister, Dr. Ivan. I bring you timely word from the Lord. Hallelujah. I appreciate all those who are checking already to this particular session. It's an exciting moment for me because the Lord has given me a very beautiful word. You know, I feel so happy when the Lord releases words of, you know, words of celebration and words of congratulations to his people hallelujah your first time to click on my video god bless you returning viewers subscribers god bless you do not forget to subscribe if you're new and consider to like this video and the lord bless you in the name of jesus now the lord says i should give you this word. you know it was so funny the way he said it he was like how come you 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 don't know all this why you have been going through a test yeah he said all this why you have been going through a test now this is the picture that the lord showed me this particular person you have gotten to this point where to you every other thing can be a lie every other person can be a liar but god alone remains the only one that says the truth like the scripture says let every other man be a liar and let god alone be the only true one because this is what happens several times you've had confirmation from the lord he has told you this is what he wants you to do and while you engage in it you just find out like he was not the one that sent you you just find out like you know things fail and they crumble in your hand but despite all that your faith and your trust in god kept moving forward you know like i said during the live stream God will always test you before he gives you. One thing God will not do is to give you something that you will worship, something that will draw you away from him. And if he realizes that you see idolize a thing, he will not give it to you. And this is the test that he puts you through. He made you to go through this in order to see whether you will prioritize him, his purpose, and his, you know, his affairs over that which you are seeking for him. And he says, I should tell you congratulations from the book of Genesis 27, verse number 29. He says, you have passed the test. Now, may nations serve you and people bow down to you. Be Lord over your brothers and may the sons of your mothers bow to you. May those who curse you be cursed and those who bless you, they will be blessed because you have contended with God and you have found his favor in the name of Jesus. Amen. Love you. Shalom.